You did it. Incredible. I won't ask how. However, I will need time to do my work. Perhaps you'd be willing to help us out here for just a bit longer? I need you to go back out there. We're running out of aluminum potassium sulfate, and its use is crucial to our research. Can you get me that chemical from the warehouse? I'll try. Do be careful with it. I could use some help with the research. We can't really tell whether the drugs actually help the infected. Transformation takes place so quickly it's impossible to take a proper sample. John and Nick agreed to test the drugs on themselves, but we don't have the results yet. I'm in. All right. We managed to lock a few of the infected in the stockroom. You need to draw the sample from their muscle tissue. But hurry, if they mutate any further, it'll be too late.
That's it! Yes, you did it! Good! Very impressive, thank you. This may furnish a few pieces still missing from the puzzle. The pieces are... Kuru is endemic among the native population here, but the incubation period can take up to 12 years. Many of the natives here have built up an immunity which keeps the virus latent even longer. But this new virus is very different. It goes full-blown within hours. I think I may be able to create a vaccine, but to do so, I need a stable version of Kuru that hasn't yet mutated. Can you help me with that? Yes. You must find someone from Ope's clan. Someone who hasn't had any contact with the infected and get a sample of their blood or tissue. Speak with the shaman, because I don't know if anyone like that even exists. All right, then. Now you just need to find someone from Opie's clan who hasn't had contact with the infected. And they don't even have to be bloody alive. See, they have a practice here where they embalm the dead, turn them into mummies, right? You just need to find one of these mummies and take a sample. Listen to me. Emily is still alive. We still have a chance to save her. I heard Dr. West say you would help. We devised a formula that can render someone temporarily invisible to the undead. It uses a pheromone inhibitor and fools them into believing that you are not among the living. But, to complete the formula, I need a compound called Icaridin. It's highly volatile, and we keep it in chemical storage. Do you think you can find some and bring it back? I'll do my best. Très bien. The storage facility you want is behind the main building. Do you have the compound I need? Hello, have you a mo If you happen to be near the bungalows, could I ask you a favor? Could you look in bungalow number three for my work files? They should be on the desk with my laptop. I was working on protein folding simulations. If you find them, please bring them here. It would take us days to recreate that data, and we don't have days. Okay. Great, I'll be right here waiting. Thank you. Did you find my laptop? Did you find my laptop? Have you even looked yet?
You have it! Très bien! Okay, give me a minute. I will mix the formula. There it is! Thank you! This could make all the difference! I need some assistance. But to continue my research, I need you to find something for me. I need a large quantity of diseased tissue from a specific type of the infected. I'm interested only in those that are bloated and swollen as if they'd been drowned and left to rot. Yes. They can be found near large pools of water. I'm sure there are quite a few in the nearby swamps. Have you- This'll do just fine. I'll tell Dr. West how helpful you've been.
Welcome! Every person in my village ate the flesh of the immortals. But many did not resurrect. The spirits are angry with us. The only warriors left are in the tombs of our ancestors. It is in the mountains near our village. Take me to your boat and I will lead you. Far before the first of my kind walked the land, before this world even existed as it is, there was another time. The dream time. In this time, nothing had substance, and there was no life or death. Can't hurt to look. We existed without fear, without pain, without purpose. We travel there in our sleep, for the dream time is always with us, waiting in the darkness. who watch over us rose from deep within the void and darkness and created the sky and the sea and the land and everything alive and everything that isn't. The great serpent who created the sea and great mother who gave us life still watch over us. Do you see them? <laughs> The immortals, the resurrected, their spirits remain on this plane. They live in both worlds, the dream time and our time. That is why they are sacred. <laughs> They consume us to become one with us. Another one! Don't let them stop us! Monster!
what I understand, they worship these bloody things. They are the infected to become resurrected. So I'm afraid you might have some problems with this shaman. Keep an eye on him, right? Come. I'll wait in the boat, but hurry up, okay? This place is evil as evil can be. We make the sacrifices for the spirits at this altar. Beautiful. There. I see one. Here is my village. Angry spirits are everywhere. Stay close to me. Maybe we will avoid a fight. <laughs> Resurrected Ratas are great warriors. <laughs> Follow me quickly. We must leave the village at once. Dressed for this. Hear that? Those whispers are a warning.
beautiful here, but it is unholy. something in here. We have to get to the other side. They want to stop us. Destroy the lever. Get to the second lever and use it. See any mummies? No! What the hell? Very bad spirits. Stay away. That man? That was fucking voodoo. Not a living dead shit. I don't see any bite marks. If she didn't eat those stiffs, then she's probably fine. And what if she ain't fine? Maybe you should ask her, huh? Hey, Shorty, we have some zombie for lunch? She's saying something. I had to. Everyone had to. They believe. If they'd eat. They would live forever. We have to take her with us. First, we need to find them damn mummies. Shit. Over here! Now what? Fuck! Let's get the hell out of here! If you want to get to the village, I know a shortcut. I was born here. We need to go this way. Yeah. 
Mahala, watch out! There's more of them here than you think. Look there, at the altar. Is that your friend? <laughs> Quick, you have to help him. This place seems safe. I'll join you once you've helped him. I kill you! Dale! Thought I was gonna find something valuable here. Instead, I get tricked like a stupid kid.
Is it safe? you free! All right? I thought I was going to die. If this mummy has been properly preserved, the DNA might still be intact. This might just work, but it will take some time. We may be able to save this island after all. As for the girl, I need to check her blood. 
If she's infected, she should stay here. We'll be in touch. How long can this take? Emily's hanging in, but she's sick. Very, very sick. You need to talk to Moen. Despite what he said, he knows the way to the prison here. He's the only one who can get you in. So you do whatever you have to. Otherwise, nobody's gonna make it. Anything will help. Brothers, you saved my life for the second time, so I owe you one, yeah? Your friend wasn't lying. I do know the way to the prison. It's fucking dangerous, so I don't like to go. But if you want, I take you there. Before we go, though, we gotta stop in town and get some necessary things. Listen, friends, there are two things that need to be taken care of before we head out. First thing is gas for the boat. We won't get there on fumes. The second thing is something special for Titus so he lets us through. Otherwise, we can forget about ever getting inside. So what's it gonna be? Of course. Okay, then. You'll find a fuel at the gas station. If you can find a car while you're there, you'll get back a lot quicker. I keep the stash for Titus in the red container by the seaside hangars. Here's the key to the storage unit. I'm staying here. I'll watch the boat. Good luck. 